Well, hi everyone, and welcome to TWF Friday Night Smackdown. I'm Michael Cole, here with Bob Walk and with Corey Graves. And today on Friday Night Smackdown, we are going to see, well, we don't know what we're going to see, <clears throat> but hopefully it's going to be, you know, a good show, Michael Cole says. Well, you got that right, Bob Walk says. It is going to be a good show, you know, and hopefully something good's going to come out of this show here today, you know. <clears throat> Sorry for all that coughing, you know. There's something good's going to come out of that show here today on Friday Night Smackdown. We well, I can tell you one thing right now, Michael and Bob, you know, Corey Graves says, we don't know what's going on. But we got Mora coming in the ring now, and somehow she would be on cloud ah cloud nine, you know, being on cloud nine, you know, since she is now the TWF, and since she now has the right to fight for the TWF heavyweight and world heavyweight winnings against Seth Rollins, you know, at Wrestle Dream later ah, early ah, coming up soon this month. Yeah. All right, Morris says. I know there are some folks here that might not be too happy with me, you know, having the right to fight Seth Rollins for the TWF heavyweight and world heavyweight winnings. That at the end of the day, there might be <coughs> someone out there who might think that the only grounds, Mora, to why you even got your right to fight Seth Rollins was that CM Punk got wounded and you were the, and they just chose you. Well, first off, I'm truly, you know, I'm truly sorry to hear about CM Punk being wounded and all. I had nothing to do with it. I wish him a, I wish him a, you know, a speedy comeback. <clears throat> but it looks like <clears throat> me and Seth Rollins are going to be the both fighting for the TWF heavyweight and world heavyweight winnings come Wrestle Dream. I know it's a W yield show, but the TWF offshoot from all yield shows between MAC, WWCW, WWF, WWE, ECW, both the E's. TNAW, GSW, IW, TNAW, and the NWA, I guess, and AEW. I guess OVW too. So, I just want to say that why I got that shot and knew that someone else did not shit. You never knocked that thing over. You knew it. There we go. <clears throat> so, here it comes, folks. So that's all I just want to say, how I got my spot. And for anyone who wants to scave me for getting my spot, because someone else got wounded, lift them. You can't stand up. Neither offshoots of Mora can stand up in the ring, so. All right. <clears throat> all right, Otis draws and it goes. I just want to know if you want to have a match with me here today, you know, on Friday Night Smackdown. That's all I want to know. Yeah, I believe so, Otis, that I would like to have a match, you know, you know, here today, you know, on Friday Night Smackdown. And that's only if Astronomy is open-minded to having me have this match or not. Well, here she comes now. You'll need my stand because I can't stand up in this ring. Alright. 
I know most of the time someone will come into someone's work room and they'll ask them for a match or something. And I know most of the time I come out. So if you two want to have your match here today on Friday Night Smackdown, then by all means, we'll do it. Well, we just heard from Astronema, you know, that we're going to see Otis Drosnick take on Mora here today on Friday Night Smackdown, Michael Cole says. Yes, we are, Bob Walk says. We are going to see, we're going to see Mora and Otis Drosnick here today on Friday Night Smackdown, which is going to be a wonderful match. I don't know to tell you right now, Michael and Bob, but I don't think that, I think it was really dumb for Mora to take this match of Otis Drosnick here today. Not that she can't handle herself. It's that if she gets wounded, then who is the TWF leadership team or matchmaking team going to choose to fight Seth Rollins then? And Mora thought she could take down Otis Drosnick, but it looks like it's not going to happen. I mean, who are they going to pick to fight Seth Rollins next if she gets wounded in a match, Corey Graves says. You bring up a good ground, Mike. We run a good ground, Corey. For once, I do stand with you, Michael Cole says. You do bring up a good ground. What will happen if Mora gets wounded? Who would be the next in row to fight Seth Rollins? Come wrestle dream, Michael Cole says. I believe that is, I believe that's up to the leader. <coughs> I believe that it's up to the leadership team or the matchmaking team to come up with that one. Bob Walk said if it happens or not. And more is down. And now her hair is getting everywhere on herself. <coughs> now her hair is getting, you know, over the over the stead now. Bob Walk says. And Otis Drosnick now is going to get ready for the wingless butterfly. The wingless moth. Since the word caterpillar is most most likely a Latinist French is borrowed word. And there he goes. <clears throat> now Michael Cole says he's gonna come from the top steeple now. Off the rope and down. Oh and down on more, Michael Cole says. I mean there was an offshoot of the toy wrestling gathering in the early days. This would have been some this would have been the early days before the toy wrestling gathering came into being, Michael Cole says. They had some LJN dolls, the LJN WWF ring at the time. And they used to say coming off the top boat because they couldn't say the word rope right. Well, Corey Graves says, yeah, when was that? When did that happen? Years ago? I, <clears throat> I don't know. Otis draws in it coming out. Oh, Mora just hit him with the Hawaii spike. And down went Otis Drosnick, who came from who came from the American Frith Center or the Vinlander Frith Middle, Michael Cole said, for those folks who don't understand English words, but they should. You should understand both the borrowed words and the English words. Well anyway, it's like this match is over, Bob Walk says. Yes it is, Corey Graves says. No one gets up from a Hawaii spike. One, two, Three. Ding ding ding. Here is your winner, Mora. And Mora just beat, you know, <coughs> Otis Drosnick here today on Friday Night SmackDown. And once again, sorry for the coughing. There's really not much you can do about it. It always seems to happen when we're making films. But any other time, it doesn't happen. And Scott's shifting things around his room or something. All that hard work just to look for a lefty, so lefty workable double blades. Well, it was a good match that we had here today on Friday Night Smackdown, Michael Cole says. Yes, it did. Yes, it was, Bob Walk said. We did have a good match here today. I'll tell you one thing right now, Corey Graves says. 
You know, I do not know why Mora had to take the match for Otis to Rosnick, Corey Graves says. Ugh. But she's lucky she didn't get, you know, wounded. Because who knows what they'd have to do if that would happen. All right, we'll take it away now to Joey Styles. <clears throat> Thank you, Michael Cole and Bob Locke. I'm going to be talking with Mora here today on Friday Night SmackDown. All right, Mora. You're now, you now have the right to take on Seth Rollins at Wrestle Dream for the TWF Heavyweight and World Heavyweight winnings. However, there might be some folks out there who might scave you for that. First off, there's always going to be folks out there, Joey, who <coughs> are going to scave you for anything. They're going to scave me and say that I only got the right to fight Seth Rollins because CM Punk got wounded. If CM Punk didn't get wounded, I wouldn't have gotten a shot. You know. Now anyway, it is what it is, you know. If they're going to scave it, oh well. There's really not much I can do about it. But I do know one thing. Me and Seth Rollins are going to have, going to have the match <coughs> at Wrestle Dream for the TWF Heavyweight and World Heavyweight winnings. So I think it would be a good match. Well, Mora, do you think you're going to beat Seth Rollins? I don't know if I will or not beat Seth Rollins. I can't foresee the upcoming or the soon to be. So I don't know what's going to happen. But I can only hope that I'm going to beat Seth Rollins. I can only hope that I'll become a free time TWF heavyweight and world heavyweight fighter. Well, <clears throat> that's my talk with Mora. Back to you, Michael Cole and Bob Walk. Thank you, Joey Styles, for talking with Mora here today on Friday Night Smackdown. And that's all the time we got here for Friday Night Smackdown. I, Michael Cole, Bob Walk, and Corey Graves. We hope you like Friday Night Smackdown. And we'll see you tomorrow for Rampage or Ram Through. And don't forget, folks, tomorrow there will be a Xena film being made tomorrow, too. <laughs>